more Fort Myers. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get to the NFL. There you go. And back. I'll start you guys on the whistle. Just get to your next station. For the past six years, Tommy Bohannon has been giving back to the community. Head up, head up, head up, look forward. Through the gridiron. Dance. Hoping to inspire the next generation of NFL talent. You know, I think it's to, to reach as many kids as we possibly can in Southwest Florida, to truly, you know, help as many kids as we possibly can. That's our goal. And, you know, to grow each and every year and get more and more kids out here, that's what we're all about. Set the quarterback. There we go. And word has spread quickly. Hit, hit. The rip. As the camp saw a record 250 athletes from across Southwest Florida, and even from all the way up the East Coast. I just moved here from New York. As athletes like Zane Kiplin are using camps like these to get to know athletes in his area. So I got to meet people. I got to learn more about football so I could be better at it. And here everyone cares about football, so when you play, yeah, it really matters. Head up, head up, head up. For others like ninth grader Adrian Branch Lopez, he's hoping camps like these will help him in his goal of becoming a D1 athlete. It's going to get my name out there and all that, um, maybe get recognized by some schools I wanted to go to, and maybe get some offers. Go! And just like a lot of other athletes out here, Adrian's got quite a list of schools he's hoping to hear from one day. Go! Definitely Miami, FAMU, HBCU, um, maybe Alabama, uh, Oregon. You gotta make a little contact. But whenever and wherever that opportunity comes knocking, Adrian knows these camps will help give him the best shot at accomplishing his goals. Go to college, make it to the NFL, just make my mom proud. There's no limit, really, because, like, sky's the limit, feel me? At North Fort Myers High School, John Barron, Fox 4.